चैप्टर नंबर वन जोग्रफी कंटेम्प्रेरी इंडिया पार्ट वन एन सी आर टी क्लास नाइन सो दिस इज द इंट्रोडक्शन विच सेज दैट इंडिया हैज प्रोग्रेस इन द फील्ड ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर इंडस्ट्री टेक्नोलॉजी एक्सेट्रा एंड वेन वी टॉक अबाउट द लोकेशन इंडिया इज अ वास्ट कंट्री लाइंग एंटायरली इन द नॉर्दर्न हेमिसफेयर सो दिस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट दैट इट लाइज एंटायरली इन द नॉर्दर्न हेमिसफेयर ऑल्सो वेन वी टॉक अबाउट द लैटिट्यूड extent the latitudinal extent latitudes since it is in the northern part so the latitudes extend from 8 degrees 4 minutes north to 37 degrees 6 minutes north so as you can see north and north so it is entirely in the northern hemisphere next we need to look at the longitudes longitudes so when we talk about the longitudes the extent the longitudinal extent of india is 68 degrees 7 minutes east to 97 degrees 25 minutes east all right so we've seen the latitudes and the longitudes next we need to understand that a very important thing that the tropic of cancer tropic of cancer passes through india and it divides the country in almost two equal halves so it passes through india so this is important all right so uh, as you know that topic of cancer is 23 degrees 30 minutes north of latitude so let's locate this in the political and physical map so that we have a better understanding of what we are talking about All right so these are the maps of india some important things that we need to note here are that the latitudinal extent from west to east is 2933 kilometers so from west to east it is 2933 kilometers from north to south kashmir to kanyakumari it is 3214 kilometers 3214 kilometers other things that we need to note here is that the tropic of cancer passes through india and it divides the country in almost two equal parts the states from where it passes are gujarat the first one is gujarat from west to east second is rajasthan third is madhya pradesh fourth is chatisgarh fifth is jharkhand sixth is west bengal and in northeast india seventh is tripura eighth is mizoram so tripura and mizoram are the only two states from where the uh, tropic of cancer passes in northeast india some states that you might uh, commit mistakes while uh, checking this thing is that odisha is one state from where it does not pass uh, th this is where one can commit mistake and uh, chatisgarh is where from it passes all right so the neighboring countries of uh, india are pakistan afghanistan as you can see here tajikistan is not a neighboring country it does not have common borders and uh, Tibet, China, Nepal and Bhutan and uh, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka and the Maldives. All right, so these were the important things about the maps of India. So this is the location of India. Before we look at India, let's look at the continents of the world. So this is North America, this is South America, this is Africa, this is Europe, this is Asia and this is Australia. Important oceans: Pacific Ocean, Atlantic Ocean, North and South. and indian ocean and again the pacific ocean as the globe is round right so when we talk about india we must note down that 82 degrees 4 minutes north is the standard meridian of the country and uh, we must also know the respective locations of the continents and other countries which are to the west or to the east of india this is really important to have strong grip over geography all right india's geographical area is 2.4% of the entire world 2.4% of the entire world in area geographical area it is the seventh largest country of the world seventh largest country next we need to understand that the himalayas are yangfold mountains and they are to the uh, northwest and extending to the northeast till the patkai boom so they are yangfold mountains right so we have arabian sea and bay of bengal to the southwest and southeast of the indian peninsula respectively arabian sea and bay of bengal 
right so next we need to understand that since there's uh, there's a huge uh, longitudinal extent of india starting from gujarat to arunachal pradesh there are so many uh, small meridians pass, uh, passing through the entire country that is why there is a time lag of 2 hours between gujarat and arunachal pradesh that is the reason why we have a standard meridian time which is 82 degrees and 30 minutes east passing through mirzapur in UP. So these are some important points that we must know. Right, so we've already located India's neighbor countries in the map. So there's no need to do it again. So you can, still you can read it from here. And uh, you can answer these questions in the comments section. Please answer them. And the most interesting one is the number of Union treaties along the western and eastern coasts. I'll give you a hint. Two of them start from D, one starts from A, one starts from L, one starts from P. Right, so write it down in the comment section. And this was the chapter 1 for NCRT class 9. So this is it for this video. The PDF notes for this video are available on the Civil Coursify Android app for free. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, download the Civil Coursify Android app and follow us on Facebook and Telegram. Links are available in the description as well as comment section. Till then, thank you and take care.